everyone! Welcome to my channel. So today I am very excited to be unboxing the Huga Box for July of 2024. Now, if you're unfamiliar with the Huga Box, it is a cozy box where each month you get cozy Huga inspired products. Huga is a Danish word and it has to do with the relaxation elements of light and warmth and different things like that. And so in this box, you will get different cozy things. It's kind of like cozy Huga self-care. There are two different size subscription boxes. You can get the standard box that comes with four items for $52 a month. And then the deluxe comes with five to six items for $56 a month. So only four more dollars. Um, and they do send this box to me free for review and they send me the deluxe box. And because of that, I do also have a coupon code down below where you can get 5% off your first box. So like I said, you'll get elements of light, things like candles or fairy lights, hot drinks like teas and cocoa, um, indulgences like maybe biscuits or chocolate. It also has things like home decor, accessories, um, wellness items, and just things that will bring you cozy, happy moments. With that, welcome back to all the Subbox lovers out there. Welcome if you're new. My name is Katrina and on my channel, I unbox lots. Of different subscription boxes. So if you like subscription boxes, definitely make sure to give this one a thumbs up, make sure you're subscribed, and let's dive in. I am so happy that you're here hanging out with me today unboxing this box. I also literally just took my hair out of a bun yesterday. I did the curling, so it's kind of like, um, hopefully it will kind of like a little bit during the next couple hours or so, but it's cute. <laughs> so the box itself is super cute and is covered in little different Huga things. And when you open it up, that is what it looks like. It talks a lot more about Huga at the top. And then you get the little card, which you could use as an art print, but on the back, it does go over all of the products in the July box, which is a summer or Zoma Huga theme. So it says summer radiates with a vibrant warmth, a brightness that spills into every corner of the day, uh, not just from the generous sun, but from the lively buzz of long leisurely evenings and the invigorating breeze that carries the scent of blooming flowers and fresh cut grass. Carve out your own sun drenched moments. The to-do list can wait and relish in slow, joyful activities. Savor the flavors of summer. Oop, let me, because I don't know if anything that it's saying there might be getting into the box itself, but Let's dive in. Okay, so on the card, it does delineate what comes in the regular box and what comes in the deluxe box. And actually the first thing on top is the thing that comes in the deluxe box only. So we're gonna start with that. And it is this here. So this is a set of wooden spreaders. They have a natural or nature inspired theme on them. So these are perfect for soft cheeses, butters, jams. Um, and each of these is crafted from durable beech wood with a natural oil finish. Um, so it has whimsical laser etching designs, and these are seven inch spreaders. Ooh, so a little touch of Huga. You can have a nice little cheese board. They do have like different shapes uh, to them too. So like they're different types of spreaders in there. That is super cute for like a little summer cheese board. They feel really nice too, and they are definitely super cute. So again, you would only get this if you paid for the deluxe box. The standard box would not come with this, but everything else in the box after this will be in both. Up next, we have this here, which are luminary lanterns. So it says simply add water and drop in the flameless water activated LED candles to create a captivating ambiance. Um, these are inspired by Candace Wheeler's 1881 Bees with Honeycomb design from Mark Twain's Hartford home. These lanterns bring a touch of historical elegance and cozy charm to your decor. Enhance your nights with their magical light. Okay, so yeah, it's like opens up like a bag. You fill it with water and you put that in. That is very interesting. That is reusable, recyclable, flameless. Okay, so there's like four of them in here. So, and these are reusable and they just open up like so. Yeah, and you just put water in then just the little LED candles which are in there as well. Huh, okay, that's cool. I like the design, but I feel like you could also take those water activated candles and put them in some other type of container. It does say that these will expand when you put water in them. But again, if you don't, I mean, I think this design is very cute, but I think you could use those like little lights in other things too um, for the water activated things. So super cute. That's your little element of light. All right, up next we have this here. This is peach iced 
tea. Um, this is made from per, per, <laughs> pure Ceylon black tea. Um, it's an unblended single estate leaf brew. Um, so it has a bold, smooth tea with a rich character and a hint of light cane sugar. So each one ounce tea bag makes a gallon of peach flavored iced tea per cooling down um, and savoring timeless moments. Ooh, okay. Um, and the, the packaging on this is super duper cute. So it's from Oliver Pluff & Co. Yeah, it does brew one gallon. As somebody who doesn't drink a lot of tea and I really only drink them by the cup, I'm not really like a big gallon of tea person, but I do feel like it is a very Southern thing. Oops, let me knock the whole box down. Um, it is a very Southern thing to like have a whole gallon of tea on the go. Ooh, okay, very peach themed in this box. The next thing out is this here. This is some peach jam. This is Italian peach jam and it's made with organic peaches and cane sugar and it's crafted with succulent Italian peaches. Oh, I already said that. <laughs> it offers a rich, authentic flavor um, and it's a natural hue, but it's slightly darkened by the cane sugar. So it says it's perfect on toast or you could stir it into yogurt, um, however you want to do it. Ooh, this actually looks very, very good. And this is actually like made in Italy, which is very cool. Up next, we have this super cute little bowl. Um, so this is the perfect blend of rustic charm and timeless elegance. This is a dessert bowl, though you could use it however you want. Um, so it's a 12 ounce bowl crafted from 100% porcelain and it has a reactive glaze that creates beautiful variation in color and texture. So every piece is unique. Um, it's dishwasher and microwave safe, which is really awesome. So yeah, you could use this like for dessert, you put your little yogurt with your peach jam, but you don't have to use it for food either. You know, you can put this to put like rings or keys or different things in as well. I really love this bowl and I like the, it's like an irregular shape as well. Super cute and kind of like a peachy rustic color to go with the peachiness of the box. And then last but not least, we have this super cute mini bath bomb. It's a peach mini bath bomb. Um, it is handcrafted and individually painted in Menominee Falls. Um, and it's a fresh peach scent. Oh, it smells really good. Um, so it transforms your bath into a luxurious aromatic escape. Y'all know I love a good bath product. I love bath bombs, bath boxes, all that kind of stuff. Oh, and this smells really, really good. All right, so that is everything in the Hugger Box for July. I thought this was really fun. I love all the peach theme. It definitely does feel summer. One, I, peaches are kind of summery. I feel like these spreaders definitely feel like summer, like summer charcuterie board, just like light. I don't know, I'm just into that. And then the little lanterns are super cute and fun as well. So yeah, I thought this was a really fun box. I'm excited, I'm really excited to taste this jam because it looks delicious. So definitely let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. What did you think of the Hoga box for July? Again, I do have that coupon code down below where you can get 5% off your first box. If you like this video, definitely make sure to give it a thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss out on future uploads. And I'll see you in my next video.